Still in my comments talking about why you posting your wife. Because she make me happy. That's why y'all happy with the music. Because I'm happy. You understand? Kanye West is gradually destroying his new wife, Bianca Sensori. Get this, Kanye has a fashion sense that turns heads. Unfortunately, it's a whole different story regarding his wife. She wears off-putting dresses, suggesting that the hip-hop star handpicks her dresses. Worst of all, the Melbourne architect had long black sleek hair, but after exchanging vows with Kanye, she now rocks a bold low cut. It does seem like Kanye wants to ruin her, just like he's doing with his personal and professional life. He barely has friends, and brands have since let him go. Is Kanye's relationship with Bianca the straw that would break the camel's back? Is he battling a mental condition that no one is paying attention to? Is it all over for him? Or is there a silver lining after the storm? This jaw-dropping video answers these mind-boggling questions on the condition that you stay till the end. Days ago, LA's weather forecast predicted a 100% chance of rain. But then, experts couldn't predict how residents would take it. Bianca Sensori took this warning too far as she wore a raincoat during an outing with her husband, Kanye West. It's not the coat that got people talking, but the fact that the Aussie model was naked. Good enough, she wore the transparent rain poncho to protect herself from getting wet. Her inner clothes managed to cover her breasts. It is unclear what she wore down there, but she skillfully positioned her hand to cover that area. Well, you can guess she was wearing a skimpy nude colored thong. She complimented her looks with knee-high stiletto boots as she strutted with her rapper husband to the studio. Ironically, Kanye was covered in full waterproof attire in his signature black ski mask and khaki poncho. It was oversized enough to cover Bianca too, but he would rather have her naked. Fans wonder why Bianca ditched her underwear and had her bum on full display. Well, Bianca isn't new to showing off her body. It's not the first time she has appeared publicly wearing skimpy outfits. In fact, Kanye actively shares sultry photos of her on social media. The rapper recently posted pictures of his wife modeling outfits half naked. One of his latest videos showed the 29-year-old sporting a sheer bodysuit. Unlike in other posts, she had several other scantily dressed clones walking around her in circles. They wore the same outfit as her, including white fluffy boots. In one Instagram post, he declared that 2024 was the year of no pants for Bianca. He shared another picture of Bianca, a micro thong and fur bralette. He also posted a photo of her wearing a thong and leather mask over her head while cooking in the kitchen. Bianca probably looks all right outside, but fans advocate that she needs to be rescued from Kanye West. They sense that she's in trouble and doesn't know how to go about it. One fan commented, somebody rescue this lost woman, please. Anybody out there who can help her? Another concerned fan noted that Kanye is always fully dressed, yet he ensures his woman is half naked. Rumors making the rounds suggest that Bianca cut ties with her family and friends since her romance with Kanye. It remains uncertain if she did it willingly or if her husband directed her to do so. Days ago, a TMZ reporter confronted the controversial rapper asking about the dynamic of their relationship. She wondered if Bianca had free will or was under his control. People wanna know if, if Bianca is, has her free will. Some people are saying you're controlling her. This didn't sit well with him. He flared up and immediately snatched her phone before launching into a huge rant. Why do you feel that's okay? I'm a human being, he fumed. What do you feel like it's okay I'm a human being? All of this TMZ, this 30 miles on y'all. He thought that the question was disrespectful. He then demanded her full name and address. How do you know me, miss? I'm, I'm I don't not, know you. What is her name? What is this lady's name? I'm sorry. No, you're not just. Saying he would pay her double to work for him instead. Address, what you make here? I'll pay you double what they pay you. Woo! Anyway, he left the question unanswered. But then, a source told Daily Mail that the rapper is pushing Bianca's naked pictures all over social media to control her narrative. He is shutting her from the world and causing her to feel isolated. Speaking of shutting Bianca from the world, we hear Kanye banned her from social media. According to a post on Daily Mail, the heartless singer deliberately keeps his wife away from social media platforms to avoid negative comments. An unnamed source recalled that Bianca has always been a social media person. 
In fact, she had been active across several channels until she married Kanye. Her family alleged that her husband doesn't want her to use social media because reading nasty comments would hurt her. He reportedly convinced her she is a star and must remain a mystery. Unfortunately, her close buddies feel this is a form of control. This is certainly a case of Bianca having no choice but to do his bidding. The Australian architect's friends say that the once strong Bianca is now a shadow of herself. She went from being a designer to his wife. Worst of all, it's not a paid position. This young woman is stuck and needs help. Remember that Kanye has been accused of trying to control his partners in previous relationships. Relationship experts say the rapper shows obvious red flags as he controls how the women he dates dress. First was model and actress Julia Fox. She revealed that he completely transformed her closet days after their first meeting. She told Interview Magazine that he gifted her a hotel suite full of new clothes. After the second date, he convinced her to get rid of her old clothes. What? Who does that? Julia admitted that days later, her boxes of old clothes were gone. It was like she packed up her old life. She moved on with her life only after the relationship crashed. Kanye also tried this with Kim Kardashian. Kim admitted in an episode of Keeping Up With The Kardashians that he overhauled her wardrobe. He picked out items that he didn't like and asked her to throw them away. She confessed that the overhaul was too much for her. She cried after seeing that he got rid of some of her colorful clothes. After they parted ways in 2021, Kim admitted struggling to pick out outfits without her ex-husband's help. She reached a stage where she sought guidance on every matter. It's not just Kanye's exes that are sending warnings about him and all his red flags. His fans and other rappers believe he's not a gentleman. This guy gets under people's skin so easily. He's no stranger to controversy. Flashback to 2014 when Kanye pulled an unnecessary stunt. That year, he exaggerated his self-importance and misbehaved. During a concert in Sydney, Australia, he refused to continue his performance unless the entire audience stood up. Apparently, one fan did not comply and he was so angry. He commanded the guy to stand up and the crowd helped him by screaming, Stand up! Stand up! I don't want to stand up. Unknown to them, the person they were picking on was in a wheelchair. Although Kanye didn't know that the man was in a wheelchair, the situation created an ugly buzz on social media. And he was so angry. Why did he insist that everyone stand before he continued his performance? This guy isn't even on good terms with other industry players. I'm talking about Pete Davidson, Ray J, Justin Timberlake, Taylor Swift, Jay-Z, Drake, Kid Cootie, you name it. In February 2022, he shared a screenshot with many people he's feuding with. He mentioned Travis Scott, South Park, Harriet Tubman, Amber Rose, and George Washington Bush. But then he said that the list is twice as long. And no, he's not even kidding. Kanye's lyrics over the years have contained worrying references hinting at mental health struggles. On his 2004 album, The College Dropout, he rapped about feeling self-conscious, anxiety, and depression. In the song, I Feel Like That, he describes racing thoughts, confusion, and paranoia. During interviews, Kanye has also made comments that raised concern. In 2018, he openly discussed having an opioid addiction after getting liposuction. He revealed at the time that he was taking two, three pills a day. Opioid abuse often coincides with attempts to self-medicate underlying mental distress. Kanye also made headlines during a presidential rally in 2020 when he broke down crying discussing the sensitive topic of aborting his first child. His tearful outburst displayed a high level of instability and vulnerability. In a Drink Champs interview in 2022, Kanye himself acknowledged mental health issues, stating, we all are on the spectrum somewhere. He mentioned being diagnosed with a disorder and taking medication in the past. With lyrics exploring anxiety and depression, references to addiction issues, emotional volatility, and the star's own admissions, there are definite reasons for concern around Kanye West's mental health. His comments over the years, while unconfirmed, suggest he may be battling conditions like bipolar disorder, anxiety, PTSD, or others. Fans continue hoping Kanye will get the help and treatment he may need for his own well-being and stability. Is Kanye West crazy? or he's expressing a rare kind of mental illness. Perhaps the world needs to pay more attention to his words and actions. 
What are your thoughts? Feel free to share in the comments below.